In this video, we will show you how to use Network Upload Method to import or migrate PST to Microsoft 365. To begin the process of importing the PST files into Microsoft 365, you'll first need to log in to your Microsoft 365 Admin Center. Make sure that the account user you're using to log in the Admin Center has the mailbox import and export permissions. How to check? Open App Launcher on the left-hand side. Click on the Admin button. Under Admin Center, click on Show All. Scroll down, you will see the Compliance Admin Center where it will display all the permissions given to the specific account. The account I am using currently is a global admin account, so it has all the permissions. Open compliance.microsoft.com. Scroll down and click on Data Lifecycle Management. Select Microsoft 365. Then click on Import tab on the right. Click on New Import Job. This will open the Import Job Wizard. Name the Import Job. Select the Import Type as Upload Your Data. Click Next and then click Show Network Upload SAS URL. Copy the SAS URL and paste it into your notepad. Note. When naming the PST import job, you can't use spaces or uppercase letters. Download the Microsoft Azure Storage tool by clicking on Download Azure AZ Copy and install it. The AZ Copy tool helps upload PST files to Microsoft 365. It stores them on the Microsoft Cloud at a secure Azure Storage location. In this procedure, the PST storage location is known alternatively as the source location. You can choose a different source location every time you run the AZ Copy tool. Once the installation is complete, open Command Prompt on your local computer. Launch the Azure Command Line tool and run the following command to upload the PST files. azcopy.exe copy source location of PST files, SAS URL. Note, add forward slash at the end of the source location of PST files. After the upload operation completes, go back to Microsoft 365 import process and select I'm done uploading my files and also select I have access to the mapping file. Click Next. Note, CSV file will be located in the AZ Copy folder under your username data. Create the PST import mapping file in CSV as per the guidelines given by Microsoft under this document. I will share the link of the document in description as well. On the next screen, you need to upload CSV file and validate your mapping file. To validate, click on Validate. Once you're done, you'll have successfully imported the PST file into Microsoft 365. Alternatively, you can use a specialized PST to Microsoft 365 migration tool like Stellar Migrator for Outlook to speed up the process of importing PST to Microsoft 365. This tool uses Microsoft Modern Authentication and allows you to split mail items while importing and maintains complete structure and folder hierarchy. We have shared a different video on how to use Stellar Migrator for Outlook. I will share the video link in the description below. Thanks for watching.